Welcome everybody into D's Anime Defenders video. I'm gonna be showing you how to solo raid. So, I'm gonna be showing you the best build you can use in Anime Defenders to solo raid without secret units. So you can actually solo raid guys with just mythicals and legendaries and I'm gonna be showing you the best loadout to solo raid. So this is by far the best method out there to solo raid, to watch all the way until the very end. And yeah, let's just get stuck right in guys by showing you the best build slash loader for solo raids in anime defenders. Alright guys, so as you can obviously see by far this is the best build. The build that we've got is this. So this is a solo build. Um 25 million damage, which is kinda crazy, but the build is first. So we got two support units, which is going to be Pink Rockstar and Bluma. So make sure you get those two. Um, and what we've also got, guys, is Curse King, Donut Warrior, and Warrior Korean. If I'm going to be brutally honest with you, this is a very bad... It's a good loadout, but what you do need, guys, is Garp. So I highly recommend, if you guys can, switch one of the units, maybe Donut Warrior, with Garp. And then you should be chilling guys so as you can see this is a solo raid it did take only 17 minutes to complete and we ended up getting 45 shots which is pretty good so i'm not going to show you guys the placement and stuff to where to place the unit and stuff because honestly that doesn't even matter guys like you just need to get the right build once you get the best build then you are chilling the only bad thing guys is that it's that literally guys, if you want to go ahead and do it, you need quite a lot of mythicals and it's kinda hard to get mythicals if I'm gonna be brutally honest with you. But yeah, for the end of the day guys, that is the best build to solo raids in anime defenders. Thank you for watching and peace out.